welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is V. In this series, I will take you along our trip to the Maritimes in Canada. This is day three where we head from PEI to Nova Scotia on a ferry with our car and continue our food tour and adventures in the Maritimes. We woke up early and had a quick breakfast before saying goodbye to our Airbnb. We drove to the Wood Islands in PEI and rode a ferry to Caribou, Nova Scotia. The ferry ride was approximately 75 minutes. We pre-booked our ticket on the ferry and it was approximately $84 per car. Making a reservation is not necessary but there is a risk that the ferry will be full and you may not be able to get on as it is a first come first serve basis if you don't have a reservation. This ferry was well equipped. It had outdoor lookout points, a large seating area, restrooms, Wi-Fi, and places where you could buy food. It was quite windy, but the waves and the views were very nice to look at. After exploring areas of the ferry, we found a spot inside to sit for the rest of the ride. Before we knew it, we arrived in Nova Scotia. The drive from Caribou to downtown Halifax was approximately two hours. By the time we arrived downtown, we were ready for lunch. We grabbed lunch at the King of Donaire in Halifax. We ordered a pizza and got some wraps too. The pizza had some meat on it, barbecue sauce, and pineapples. These were the original wraps and they had a bit of everything in it. Overall, the food was really tasty and enjoyable. We had lunch by the water and was careful not to let the seagulls, pigeons, and ducks eat our food. With the construction happening at the time that we were here, it was extremely difficult to find parking and to get around the city. There were a lot of one-ways, no left turns, or no right turn signs, and a lot of roads were closed and only accessible for pedestrians and not for cars. After lunch, we explored downtown Halifax and walked along the waterfront. We went to Blue Nose 2 restaurant and grill for dinner. We ordered a clam chowder that comes with some bread, scallops with mashed potatoes and veggies, salmon and assorted fried seafood with the same sides. For dessert, we got ice cream at Dee Dee's. We ordered the mint chocolate chip and the mango sorbet. We stopped to get some gas before heading back to our accommodation to rest for the night. And that leads us to the end of our day 3 vlog. Thanks for watching all the way till the end. Up next in episode 4, we continue to explore Nova Scotia and visit places with breathtaking views and try new restaurants. See you in my next video and please remember to like, share and subscribe if you enjoyed this vlog.